my camera just lost connection. It just stopped. So I don't know. I hope that doesn't happen again. That was really weird. Anyways, my dad came back from church and I was pretending to be asleep because I didn't want to talk to him. And he woke me up anyways. He's like, I want to talk to you. And then he was talking about, I was like, I don't want to go to a place every week that you're saying doesn't support me. And um, he was like, well, we want you to go because it'll show respect for your family. And the thing is, my brother, this is like the first time my brother has gone to church in like two or three years, and he's 19. So I'm pretty sure he stopped going before he turned 18. Um, so I don't see why I have to go, especially if it's not even, it's something I'm really starting not to believe in. And, um, you know, I made a post about this a while ago, like, dear mom and dad, being trans is harder for me than it is for you, as hard as that may be for you to believe, um, and he actually said, Jude, this is really hard for your mother and me, uh, I turned to him and I go, do you not realize how much harder it is for me? And, um, he just kept saying that I had to go to respect my family and, um, we have to find ways to love and love each other because we're still a part of the family. And just like with my mom, he didn't ever consider that maybe I don't really want to be a part of this family anymore. Um, like, my mind was pretty much made up for a while now, but now I know that as soon as I graduate in 2013, I'm leaving. I'll maybe take like a week, I'm leaving. I will never talk to them again if I, if they're gonna keep being like this. I swear, I'm saving money. I save $10 every week, and then if I put it in the bank, my parents will double it, and then I can take it out when I'm 18. I already have like 2,000, and I'm leaving. And I'm not gonna go to any family things. My mom doesn't like going to Indiana for Thanksgiving anyways because she doesn't really like my dad's family. So, and also she wants to spend Thanksgivings with her mom because uh, my grandma has Alzheimer's and she does, she's like 84 or something. So, last year she stayed home, so if she does it again, I'm staying here. And, I mean, I was saving money for something else, but I'm saving it to leave now. I'm not going to stay in a place where people are forcing me to go to church every week to listen to stuff that I don't believe in. Like he said, he, he thinks it's still important for me to go because I need to realize that Jesus loves me. It's like, what if I don't believe in Jesus? Then you're making me go to church to listen to something that I don't believe in for no other reason than you want to change me. So, and I don't want to live in this place where they won't call me the right pronouns. They won't call me the right name. Um, he said, like, out of, we, I have to go out of respect for the family, just like they let me do things out of respect for how I feel. And I said, what, like calling me a name I hate and pronouns that aren't right? He's like, I'm just trying to come to grips with it. He's not even trying. It's not like he's even trying to change. So if he was, if he like was trying to call me Gabriel, I messed up, that'd be one thing. The fact that he, like, I swear to God, he goes out of his way to call me his daughter. And every time he does it, I specifically stop talking. And, like, 
just stop talking for the next hour just to make it known that I'm not gonna do with that. I wanna leave. I'm leaving this house. And they're starting to make me hate them. Hmm. I wanna leave. So, I turned 18 April 18th of 2013 and then I'll probably graduate like a month later and I'm gonna take my money which hopefully will be like four thousand dollars or more depending on what happens and I'm leaving I'm gonna move away and I'm probably not gonna talk to them very much and it sucks but I'm not gonna deal with this